Hey guys, it's Van Rishid here from uh, RishidReviews.com and uh, I'm going to do another tutorial video here today and basically what I'm going to teach you is how to create a sales page uh, using this uh, platform here called Profit Canvas. If you want to learn more about Profit Canvas, I've uh, done quite a few reviews on this already. Just check out my website, I'll leave a link down below. And also check out my uh, YouTube videos, I've got uh, about 3-4 videos just on this one product alone. Now, if you want to know in a nutshell what it is, it's an all-in-one platform, create sales page, bonus pages, you know, squeeze pages, all types of pages. Uh, it's got training in there. You got pop-ups. You got videos. Check it out. I think it costs about forty-seven bucks on its own. Uh, it's a one-time payment, and it's uh, well worth it. But uh, what I want to do, I'm gonna just get straight into it, and I'll teach you how to uh, create a sales page using this. Once I've logged in, I'll open it up, and I'll quickly show you exactly. And there's a reason why you're gonna want to create a sales page as well. I'll speak about that in a second. And uh, this is it once you've um, added it. As you can see, I've created a ton of sales pages. When you first log in, if you've never used it, you're not going to have any pages. Just click on create new and start creating pages. Uh, but the platform which we're going to use, we're going to get, uh, it's not going to be in the make money online niche, it's going to be in uh, the weight loss niche. And uh, this is the platform we're going to use ClickBank. I'm sure you've heard of it. Uh, log in, it's free to create an account. Um, you know, and then come to this uh, marketplace section here and you'll come to this page. And you've got all these. Uh, Categories to choose from here, you know, arts and entertainment, betting, business, computers, internet, e marketing, business, languages. We want the health and fitness niche. Uh, go on to there, pick any uh, any of them there. And what I'm gonna do, I've already chosen one, it's called the uh, flat belly fix. So I'll just quickly uh, get onto a lot. I've already choose that one, I'll get the link, and that's the one there. So if we want to promote this. Uh, just click on that promote button. This uh, hot link generator will pop up. Uh, that's your link. Click on generate link and you've uh, got your uh, affiliate link there. Then you can send traffic to that affiliate link. I'll just show you. You send traffic to that link, copy that, send traffic to it, and that and people will land on the actual landing page. Now, there's a reason I'll show you why I'm going to create the actual sales page my way. So, if you click on there, this is the sales page what pops up. Just give it a second, I've got a lot of tabs open so it might be a bit slow. This is the actual video, this is the first thing that people turn to. Now, it's a decent video, but the trouble with this video is, it goes on for half an hour. It's, it's, it's longer than half, no one is going to want to watch a sales video which goes on for half an hour. It's like this, just going on for half an hour, you know. They have got a small text there which says read here, if you prefer to read, click here, so I'll click on that. But it's very small text there, no, some people might not see it. And this is the actual sales page. And this is where we're going to get information from to get all these pictures and the writing text from here. But as you can see, the, here's the trouble with the sales page. It goes on forever. I mean, literally, uh, I'm scrolling down, down. Who in the right mind is going to read all this? Who has got the time and patience to read this? It goes on forever before someone can get to the buy now button. There you go. That's the first buy now button there. 37 bucks order now. And is just too long so basically what I'm gonna do I'm gonna create this page but it's not gonna be the exact same page it's gonna have the, the graphics like this it's gonna have some text on it it's gonna have the 60 day money back guarantee on it and it's gonna have the order now button on it and now with some more images and I'm gonna teach you how to do that using profit canvas so basically that's that's why you would uh, create your own sales page and instead of using an expensive platform such as um, click funnels uh, which is which is good is the number one all the big guys use click for them, but it costs something like 100 bucks a month You don't want to do that. Just get profit canvas one-time payment only I think it's 47 dollars and just create your own sales page and send people out to that sales page Now the way you're gonna get information from this sales page is just gonna copy images and paste them onto uh, profit canvas And I'll show you so an image like this you just simply right click it um, Save as uh, no, it should be a save image as. Oh, let me just check out some other images. Yeah, see this way it says save images. That's how you save the actual images. But if you come across something like this, that for some reason you can't save this picture, what you're gonna have to do is just copy copy this image and put it onto your computer. And this is a Mac key, and the way you do that, you press Shift Command and Four, okay? And and, and that will pop up there. As you can see, this kind of weird thing. If you wanna save all this image? You click on it drag it along how big your image you want and then let go and if you hear that clicking sound there that is saved onto my computer now but all these other images 
obviously not, you're not going to want to copy every image, save every image, but I'll just show you. You want to kind of like a testimonial image, it'll work best, yeah, something like this, so you want to right click it and click on save as there. Okay, that'll pop up. Uh, save it, whatever, if you want to save pictures, blah, 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 whatever, you can put it in a desktop, however you want to do it. I've already saved, I've saved a few of these pictures already, to just to save time. You want to save something like this as well, and some more testimonials. You want to get information, uh, you want to save the images such as this, this ordinary button, you want that ordinary button, so copy that image, you want it, something like this, 60 day money back guarantee. It's all going to make sense. Anyway, I've copied all these images. I've copied some of the text from here, not all of the text, obviously, because you don't want a big sales page like this. That's the whole point of creating your own sales page. And then, and then that way, you just copy and paste these images and text onto your profit canvas. And now let's not waste any more time and jump into there, and I'll show you. So this is profit canvas. Obviously, if you've never used it, you're not going to get all these. These are just pages I've created. What you're going to do is come onto here, which is create new. Click on that button, uh, give it a name. Once it pops up, it's just a bit slow right now because I've got a lot of tabs open. There you go, create a name. I'll just create this uh, uh, value fix, create new, and that should be here somewhere. It's all in alphabetical order as well, so I'll have to go down to F. Uh, I think I've passed it. Flat belly fix, that's the one. Jump onto edit. Yeah, like I said, I've got a few windows open right now, so it's, yeah, it's a bit slow. One, it's not normally this slow. But there you go, and that's your page now. You can do retargeting, I can maybe target it uh, add a page title if I wanted to. This part here is not important, okay? You get the idea. I don't want to lengthen the video. Actually, let's. Yeah, you want to increase this page size. See this behind here, this page size. I want it as big as I can, so that's the biggest it will do. You can add background, you can add uh, borders. Okay, let's call the border with, let's call it a dotted line. Let's call it dashed. Well, let's, let's thicken it a little. Uh, change the color. Let's call it red. Uh, has that worked? Okay, yeah, save it. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Basically, that's it. I've just created these uh, border lines here. And once you're here, you've got all these tools here, which will explain what to do. I mean, obviously, once you've joined Perfect Canvas, watch the tutorials on how to use it. But basically, I add text here, there's links here, I can add shapes, buttons, YouTube videos, a PayPal button, opt-in form, you know me. But what we're going to want to do is add an image here. So, hold on, let me just grab that one there. Yeah, just grab it, drag it along, choose your file, choose an image. Uh, the image which we uh, just kind of uh, copied there. I've chosen that image which I just uh, copied. Uh, I can add a link to it as well if I wanted to, but um, it's not necessary right now. I can add my affiliate link which I just got from Clickbank. Just click on Upload Now. And uh, just give it a few seconds and it should yeah, properly. That's the image there. There you go. Just make that fit and that's that. That's the first part done. And then you can add some text there. I'll just show you. I'll just go through this process in a, in a, in a second. But basically, that's the image there. As you can see, it was on the sales page. Where did it go? That was the one there. Now we're just going to add some text, but you don't want to add all this text, so let's just uh, choose some text which we want to add. What I've just done is I've just gone through the sales page, I've read through the sales page, and I've, I've got some uh, content from there on the sales page. Okay, I've just um, kind of diluted it down quite a bit, and I've got some content, and I've uh, kind of copied it and pasted it onto a note file there. This is what I've done there. Okay, what is a flat belly fix? Uh, only 21 days rapid late release of system, blah, 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 blah. Like the system, uh, but it's design. So I'm just going to copy and paste this into Profit Canvas. Okay, which I've just done. So I hope that makes sense. Basically, I got information from here, and I kind of just got a few uh, words from there, a few sentences, and I'm just going to copy and paste it into here. And the way you're going to do that is just get onto all that section, put that in there, and paste it into there now. You're gonna have to make it look nice, yeah. You're gonna have to choose the right font size, how it's all done. Maybe you're gonna want to add the uh, underline this. Let me see if I can do that. Underline that. I don't know if it's worked. Oh, let, let me just basically you have to play around with this, okay? That's what you're gonna have to do because sometimes you end up underlining everything, okay? Anyway, and you can increase the size here, you can change the color. 
you get the idea. Let's see, insert this into the box, see what it looks like. Okay, that's it. Now you're going to want to neaten this out. Okay, because that does not look as good as it should be, so I'll just quickly show you how to neaten this out. The only way to do this, uh, the best way to do this is to remove this and do it in bits. So I'll add uh, quite a few text boxes in there because I don't know, because uh, I can't edit this. I can't bring that down. I want that as a headline. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, delete that. Okay, let's just move this. You can move this to one side there. Add a text file there. And this time, instead of copying the whole lot of this, I'll copy this, move that out of the way, paste that in there, increase the font, okay, I'll put it at 34, um, let's see if I can underline it, there is a way of underlining, I just don't know why it isn't working this time, must be a reason why it's not underlining, maybe I'm going to have to get in touch with the creator, and you can get in touch with the creator yourself, but uh, if you want to underline it, you'll just have to do a little bit of coding. It's not hard. You just do uh, uh, kind of that sign, the arrow sign, U in there, and do the same here. But this way, you also put a dash there, a backslash, whatever you call it. I don't even know what you call them, but basically, that's what you have to do. And that should work. Yeah, there you go. So underline there. And then paste that onto it. Well, just put that there. And then I'm going to add another text box there. And this time, I'm going to copy the rest of this. Now you can neaten this, make it look uh, really good yourself. But I'm just doing this uh, quickly, just uh, just to make this video. I put that at 25. Okay, I don't know. There's some text there. You can uh, make sure it's text right, and then place that over there. Let's just. Okay, I think that that will be alright. What we want to do, if you want to see what it looks like, just click on this save button here. You've saved it. And there's a preview section there, so click on preview. There you go, that's not too bad. That's not too bad as a sales page, you know, a nice short sales page. Slight like, uh, you know, explanation of what it is. Maybe I could add more text today. If you want to add more text, that's up to you, like I said. I'm just quickly trying to hurry up this. I just copied a few words there. If you want to add more, uh, uh, feel free. Uh, to do that and also there'll be an idea to add your own video but instead of making a 30 minute video make a short video and there's another platform which I use called Vidnami okay it used to be called Content Samurai but I think it's changed the name to Vidnami so I'll just jump onto there just to explain what that is okay this is it here it's called it's still called Content Samurai but I think sometime it's going to change its name to Vidnami because I'm getting a lot of emails saying it's going to change its name and uh, I'll just jump into some of the videos which I, I created a video for this also. I'll just show you the one which I've created. I think it was uh, this one. I created two videos there. Uh, basically, these are the videos which I've created using uh, this platform here. I'm still fairly new on this, but that one is the one I created. There's another one I created. I wanted a short one, so I created that one. It's like a sales page video, and that's like more like a review kind of thing. So it's a very simple and easy way to use. Maybe I'll do a review on this before. There'll be a link down below if you want to use it. But basically all you do, uh, you just come on here and says create video. You can get this text. I use this text here. Copy this text. Paste that into somewhere. Pick up what platform you want. What kind. Basically, you want this blue right in there. You want a square video. You don't want a square video. You want a, a normal video. So what you want to do is go to this where it says sales video. And these are all the kind of templates you can choose from. You can have, um, you know, they're all named really. The names don't even make sense. It says automotive, veterinary, author. You get the idea, so just check, pick uh, what template you want, and uh, you go with that one. So I'll just pick uh, any one at random, I'll pick uh, this one. You can preview it, see what it's going to look like. There you go. And then you use this template. And then what you want to do is title it, give it a title. Uh, and what you do is copy this, paste that into the script there. And there you go. And this is not a review of this product, but what you want to do is uh, for each slide, you want to make a see this will create another slide there. Okay, so whatever you want a slide to be created, just create obviously you do it properly. Like, so where there's a full stop, basically, you want to create a slide, another video slide will pop up. And then you go to create scenes, it will create all the scenes for you. You can add the voice track using the actual um, voice animator, the word got it in there. It's the best best voice animating 
kind of uh, software that I've seen. It's not that robotic. It's best to use um, a professional voice, but you don't have to, like in the video which I've got. And then you preview it and you download it onto your computer and add it onto YouTube. Okay, so that's the uh, content summary. Very quickly, how I made the video. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to do next. I'm going to add that video here. So I'm just I'm going to teach you how to do that. But first, I'm going to put. Uh, uh, I'll add another. Where's it go? Sorry, that's the actual preview button. Yeah, this one here. So what I want to do is add some more text here, asking people, tell, telling people to watch the video. Watch the video uh, video below. Sometimes you have to tell people what to do, otherwise they won't do it. I'm going to try and center this, see if I can center it. Okay, I don't know if that's working. Okay, I don't know why it's not happening this time, but basically if we want to center it. Uh, press it on. I think that's how you spell it. You have to spell it the... Um, this way and I forgot to put a backslash there that one there insert into box there you go make that a little bit bigger uh, also underline it don't underline it you don't have to underline it you don't have to do all this by the way it's just the way I pref prefer it there you go Put that there, and now you're going to want to add your video on the bottom there. So, you want to come where it says YouTube video, put that in there. Now, you want to get your video code there, so you want to choose the video which you want, and at the end, of, all the instructions will be provided how to use this uh, profit canvas, by the way. So, I'm just going to get a video code for this. Just give me a second while I find the video. Okay, I've just got the code now, I'm just going to paste that in here. So, that's the code. Basically, they're the end of a few letters uh, in, your vi uh, in your YouTube video. Like I said, the instructions will be provided in the actual um, and when you, when you check out the tutorials for this, uh, how to use Perfect Canvas. I'll make that a little bit bigger. There you go. Oh, is that in the middle? Try and center everything. I don't know if that big enough. Shall I make it even more bigger? Because I'm actually going to rely on this video to sell this. Okay, let's save this and see what it looks like. Let's uh, refresh this page. Just give it a second. It should the video should pop up along here. Just give it a second. It's taking a while. Oh, let's just get back to the editor. Let's just preview it this way. Click on preview. There you go. There you go. It's popped up there. Watch the video below. See there you go. It's, it's shaping up nicely now. Now what I'm gonna do, and also if you want to increase the size of this page. You just move this part section down. Hold on, let me get to the editor, sorry. Yeah, so that would be the actual sales page. So this part here, you just drag this down. Okay? So whenever you want to make this bigger, which you are going to want to do, you just drag this down, just click on it and drag it down. Now what I'm going to want to do is add my Buy Now button here. And then add some uh, some testimonials, some uh, uh, guarantees, warranties with it. So just give me a second, like I showed you before earlier, you're just going to grab those picked images and uh, place them onto there. I've been looking for some images. I think I've forgotten some images here. Um, yeah, I was looking for some of my images. I can't seem to find them. But so I'm just going to take the images again. So I've got a few images there. But basically, what I want to do is add the buy now button. So I'll come to the sales page. Let me just scroll for it, look for it again. I'm going to quickly show you how it's done. Oh, where's it gone? See this one here? Um, what was it called? Uh, Shift Command Four. There you go. And you want to copy that, boom. And the next one, you want to. This is good as well. You want to copy this one. Shift Command Four again. Copy that to there. And I think that's. I think we're good to go for now. And I think I should have these images copied. I'm pretty sure you just right-click these, and there you're good to go. Okay, so let's get back to the editor. You just grab this one here. All right, just give me a second. There you go. You just grab it. Place it on there. Then you choose the image which you just took. I think it's the buy now button. That's that one there. Place that in there. Actually, you want your link here as well. This will link to something. Actually, what you want it to do is link it directly to the actual, um, um, what do you call it? The actual um, checkout page. But I'm going to choose the um, 
You see, there's an instruction account. More instruction. I mean, teach you how to do that, but I did a separate video of that one altogether. So I'm just gonna get the raw affiliate link. Just give me a second. My link. I'm gonna place my link into there. That's my link there. I don't want it opening in the same a window. I want it up to open in a new window. That way, uh, they can still be on the sales page and upload now. And just give it a second while that uploads. There you can see uh, the actual buy now buttons appeared there. So I'll just position that into the right place. I want it centered. I'll just move this thing out of the way. I think that's in the center. And next, I want his uh, money back guarantee there. So I'll just add another image. Obviously, when you're doing this, I want you to do it a lot better than what I'm doing. Take time. I'm trying to hurry this up just to show you. Because as you can see, the video has gone up way over 20 minutes, which I don't like long videos, to be honest. There you go. Now, what you're going to do is add some testimonials. You can add some more writing, but you want the uh, images which I copied earlier. And I'm going to show you. Just want to add them. Um, actually, I might pause the video while I do that and I'll show you the end result. In the meantime, let's save this. Save this. Okay, I'll just save that one and I'll show you. Uh, preview it. Okay, this is what your page is going to look like. There's a video. There's the order now button. And when I click on that order now button, it goes directly to the order form. This is what you want to do. That's the whole point. Yeah, there you go. This is what you want to do. That's the whole point of this. Okay? You don't want this to go anywhere else. You want it to go directly to the actual um, order form like this. You don't want it to go to the sales page, if you know what I mean. Okay, where were we? Okay, now I'm going to add some more images there. Okay, where's the editor? And add some more images there showing the... Uh, I'm trying to neat it up as well. Let me just see where I've got the images. Um, See these images, I copied these images earlier, something like that, and uh, kind of uh, testimonial images as well, you know, so and so did so well, another one there, so I'm going to get some of these images which I copied earlier, I'm going to post them onto them, I'm going to pause the video while I do that, uh, you know, so it, this video is dragging on a bit, so I'm going to quickly do it for you, I'm just going to show you, so let me just pause the video while I add some images and add some more text. Okay, as you can see, I've uh, added these uh, testimonial images. Uh, you can resize these as well. There's a little slight arrow button there where it says on the corner there. As you can see, you can just click on there, make them bigger and smaller as you wish. I've just pulled out these three images. I've still not quite finished yet. I'm going to add some more images at the bottom. But right now, let's see what this looks like. Let's save this. Okay, and preview this. Let's see if I can refresh this, see if this will work. Yes, that's refresh. There you go. So this is actually what the sales page is so far. As you can see, our buy now button is way above here, whereas on the original sales page is way below. Now I'm not saying this is better than the original, but as you can see, that's the order now button which is there. And if you go, I mean, look, look how much you have to scroll through before you get there. And those images which I showed you, I basically copied from there. I've also copied this image. I've got some of the text from there. But as you can see, this is this is yeah, it's more professional sales page. It's a custom thousand to create something like this, but you can just create something like this just using this. Uh, uh, platform profit canvas Where is it? Well, yeah, this is the actual uh, image there and just create something like this and the by order now button is straight there The video is a lot shorter. I think this is like a minute long video Yes, only 45 46 seconds uh, I created this using Vidnami uh, Content Samurai As you can see it's a it's a, it's a good enough video there Got these button there. Now I'm just gonna quickly finish this page off here. I'm gonna add some more graphics, add some more of them images which I showed you earlier, and I'll show you the end product in uh, when I come back. Okay, I've just created it all now. Um, I'm happy with this. It's not too bad. I'll show you. See, this is what it looks like. And what you're gonna want to do, see, I've created. I've added some extra stuff. I've added the um, order now button twice. I've added some more um, uh, 60 day money back guarantee. I've written a bit there. What you're going to do is come over, add some privacy policy there as well. So you, what you want to do is get on this button, put it on there, uh, button text. Uh, I don't know what is it, privacy policy is it? Right, let's see. See, something like that. And add the link to your privacy policy. Yeah, you can get that from anywhere. You can Google that way to get them. And add the link, create button. That's it there. Okay, let's make that a bit of a... Uh, a color, give it a color. So that's how you change the colors, by the way. You click on any of these colors. There's the background color and the font color. So I've changed the background color. The button should be blue now. There you go. The button's blue. I can increase the size of this button as well if I wish. Make it smaller, make it bigger. It's a privacy policy. You don't need it bigger. So let's just save this. See what it looks like. Okay, that's saved. 
and let's refresh this page and I'm going to show you what it all looks like now okay this is the actual page which I've just created okay I've added these testimonials in there I've uh, copied some more images from the actual sales page this is the original sales page I copied that image there I've copied some other images there I've, as you can see the sales page too big so I can't even find them I've copied these images there um, can't find the other image but basically I'll just show you I copied I got that image from the sales page I've got this text from the sales page this text from the sales page this image there this is the bonuses they'll be getting uh, I've added another buy now button that's the image which I've uh, copied that's the um, button there that should link to whatever my privacy policy uh, if I click on there I should go straight to the checkout page that's the whole idea of this as well by the way it's 16 okay video's gone way too long you know 25 minutes nearly half an hour but there you go i think this is a fairly decent um, um sales page which i just created it's a lot shorter it's a lot easier to read a lot more understandable straight to the point there's a short video there instead of a half an hour video and if you want to learn more about it you know i could have added this to the sales page but you don't want to if i wanted to i could have placed the actual original video in there but like i said that's a 30 minute long video i didn't want that and uh, yeah, you send people to this. This is how you use Profit Canvas to create a sales page. Okay, so I think I've said everything. Uh, find this video helpful, you know. Like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And uh, check out my website. Okay, that's how you use Profit Canvas. Another thing, I'll show you how to get the link to these. Um, just give me a second. Uh, where's it gone? Where am I? Oh, sorry, I need to get into the editor. I was the this. this is the editor. So we've saved that once you've saved everything you click on save you've saved everything click on exit exit and find the actual product there flat lady fix embed this is the link there okay i can edit this link however i wish you just click on edit i can change the ending to it but i don't oh, i don't want to do that i'll just show you let me just get to the link that's the link there i can also embed it onto my website by copying that uh, iframe source there and uh, go to this link and this is the actual page here this is the actual sales page where it's going to look like and that's it there I've created a simple sales page when you first start using this system to create something like this yeah it could take you about an hour but it's well worth it make it better than mine you know use your due diligence you know get it right obviously you see this video it's not exactly in the center you see it's bigger space on there so you want to center make sure everything's in center you know go back edit it do as you wish but i think this is a, a very good sales page there everything to the point and that's the whole idea so basically you just send traffic to this link there obviously build an email list first send traffic to your uh, link and uh, you, you're good to go okay so that's uh, it's got nearly half an hour now so anyway it's fun Rashid from Rashid reviews and i'll speak to you next time